Hi, I'm Paul Pasolka, Ivy Masters Learning Center at ivymasters.com. And today we're going to look at Test 3, Section 1, Numbers 12 and 13. 12 reads, which choice does the author explicitly cite as an advantage of automobile travel in North America? You might notice this is paired with number 13. If you remember the answer to the question, you might answer 12 before 13. If you don't remember the answer to the question, but you remember where it is the passage, you might answer 13 before 12. So you want to be flexible here. It's not like you have to answer one before the other. But you also might play with this and see which one is best for you. So I've already highlighted in the passage lines for answer choice A, B, C, and D. So let's investigate. Answer choice A. In other words, traveling to work, school, or the market means being a strap hanger. Someone who by choice or necessity relies on public transportation rather than a privately owned automobile. So that's about public transportation, taking public transportation rather than taking a car. It does not look like it's answering the question, what's the advantage of taking a car or an automobile? Answer choice B. And yet public transportation in many minds is the opposite of glamour, a squalid last resort for those with one too many impaired driving charges, too poor to insure, afford insurance, or too decrepit, literally meaning having bones that creak, old, to get behind the wheel of a car. So it sounds like public transportation is a last resort for people. It sounds like people would rather take their car based on answer choice B, but it's not literally telling you an advantage. So it looks like it's not those two. Look at 24 to 26. In much of North America, they are right. Taking transit is a depressing experience. Now it does mention North America. So that's another reason answer choice A is wrong because it's not even talking about North America. This paragraph seems to be talking about North America. It says taking public transportation is a depressing experience, but we don't know what is better about taking a car, taking an automobile just yet. Doesn't look like C is correct either. Look at 32 to 34. Hopping in a car almost always gets to your, you to your destination more quickly. Now, we might have in our own mind what we think is better about taking a car, but if the passage says more quickly, we've got to answer with what means more quickly. So answer choice A, environmental impact is nowhere stated or, or implied. Convenience is that answer that you're probably going to think, hey, it's more convenient to, to take a car than to take public transportation. But that's not specifically what the passage is saying. Do not choose convenience. More quickly would be speed and has nothing to do with cost. So answer choice C is your correct answer. Read exactly what's on the page. If it tells you the sky is green, you got to answer that the sky is green. It's not what you think. It's what the passage is saying. Thank you for joining us today. If you like this video, click like. You could share it with someone who has trouble with these paired questions. If there's any question you'd like to see answered from any official PSAT or SAT or ACT, leave that in the comments. I'd be happy to shoot a video on it. And click subscribe so you don't miss anything. Have a great day.